I'm Samarth Bhatia from Santoni Electric Company Private Limited, New Delhi. We are essentially into industrial cleaning equipment. Uh, we do a lot of air pollution control projects as well, uh, dust collection, fume extraction. Then we're also into central vacuum systems for a lot of industrial spaces as well as uh, residential spaces. In this exhibition per se, we have launched a lot of concepts uh, and one product as well, one range of product I would say. Uh, we have launched a road sweeper here which is uh, essentially entirely a new concept from what uh, has been going on since many years in India. It's more suited to our uh, working conditions, that's the idea. And uh, plus apart from that we've also launched some uh, special application vacuum cleaners here for uh, specific types of industries. The platform is very good because it helps us to connect with uh, the buyers directly while they're here. They come and discuss with us in person as to what uh, you know could be their application, which is sometimes very unique. And uh, we're, like we had a couple of buyers yesterday as well, so it's it's very good to be able to connect with them in person for sure. So our core focus uh, has been that we are a manufacturer from India itself, developing the product completely in India, and which makes the products much better suited for our operating conditions. It makes the products. Uh, uh, well suited for dusty environments and uh, there are certain specific uh, uh, things that we do in terms of innovation uh, that completely differentiate our products uh, from the rest of the competition out there, especially in the sense of durability because uh, our operating conditions uh, both in terms of dust levels and operator skill are different from what you get in uh, developed parts of the world. So our biggest USP would be that we manufacture in India and uh, hence have products which are well suited for the market, both in terms of cost and performance. Well, the trend is de definitely on uh, you know, an upside always because uh, uh, as, as it uh, has been shown by various surveys, uh, the cleaning market in India is tapped to less than 5% of its true potential so far. So with 95% of the market yet to be tapped, there's always scope for you know tremendous amount of growth in this uh, segment in India. And uh, yeah, I mean, we're all here and uh, I mean, various companies are here. And I think a lot more companies can also come in and still we have a gap between demand and supply. When it comes to air pollution control, uh, essentially we're focused on industrial applications of various types. Uh, that could be applications that pertain to toxic gases also sometimes, but it could also pertain to stuff like dust itself from various uh, processes. So what we do is we wait for the client usually to approach us with an application and uh, because we differentiate again, uh, we differentiate our company from uh, regular suppliers. We don't have one type of product which we try to promote uh, to a, a specific type of client. We in fact like to develop new technologies all the time. So we've handled uh, over 3,000 diverse applications in the last 33 years of our uh, operation. So when it comes to air pollution control, it's entirely application specific for us. So we wait for the client to approach us and then we go about uh, understanding the application and then determining uh, a well-engineered solution. In fact, it puts us in a very interesting position because uh, the two lines, although they are slightly, you can say, similar to some extent, they are actually very diverse when it comes to uh, the way we approach uh, uh, the brand promotion also and how we go about uh, you know developing a solution also for any particular application so when it comes to air pollution uh, control it gives us uh, an opportunity to work with uh, various large companies uh, with, they could be of any level who are finding you know a solution which is uh, actually of a uh, you know quality level that they should be able to meet, uh, you know, in Europe also, or US also. We are literally competing with that quality level. So when we try to develop that solution, it gives us a brand positioning where we're, you know, focused on maybe doing a couple of projects a year, and we're good with that. And when it comes to cleaning machines, we have, a, you know, a range of products that can be sold every month. So literally, we have, you know, both uh, project-based work also and regular. Uh, work also which can be done on a monthly basis. So if the market is low on any one side, hopefully the other side you know, balances out for us. The laws are changing consistently. Uh, 
with the new government coming in, lot of and with the you know uh, recent uh, Paris summit as well, lot of things are changing in the Indian uh, the climate, uh, uh, yeah with the climate change and everything. So we we have a lot of things coming in, a lot of laws uh, which are hopefully gonna come in and we're gonna be at the level where developed nations are hopefully. But uh, I think what where we have suffered all these years is not with the laws itself, but with the implementation of the laws. So uh, hopefully that will also change, and we'll see uh, a lot more focus and a lot more attention from uh, you know a lot of companies, a lot of uh, uh, businesses out there, and they'll focus on being responsible towards this. Sometimes it's you know relevant to their uh, product, so that's why they spend money on uh, these uh, air pollution control equipment. But sometimes it's more relevant for the general environment and the people working in their company. So it depends what is their focus. We are here to help them for sure.